four point system of fabric inspection introduction in the textile and clothing industry the most of manufacturers purchase raw materials to produce garments fabric rolls are the best example to purchases but that purchase roll that cannot be used directly cut and spread in process because manufacturer doesn't know correctly how many damages contains in that fabric rolls therefore recheck process must be continued hence the higher damage fabric roll cannot be used to produce garments because of higher wastage and higher failure cost when launch in operation process therefore fabric inspection methods are very important to launch to eliminate fabric faults in the textile and clothing industry several fabric inspection methods are employed first one is four point system second one is 10 point system third one is mark and spencer system today i hope to give you an idea about procedure and calculation of four point system basic principle this method we check how many damages in in the 100 yards 100 square yards and he, here maximum allocated points must be 4 if total points greater than 40 then roll can be uh, if total points lower than roller can be accepted if total po point greater than 40 then roller will be rejected but today in sri lankan industry they are considering total point limitation as 28 so according to that concept if point value is higher than 28 roller will be accepted not accepted by lower than 28 then fabric wall fabric roll will be accepted damages and point allocated tables you can follow this table for four point system especially woven fabric calculations in the fabric inspection one fabric roll fabric quality inspector found following observations for an example so you it will be different for your results this is my answer fabric roll dimension length and width so inches should be converted into the yards Subscribe our YouTube channel to get new updates.